I played Palia on stream for just a few seconds and already glitched out of the map. You can oh, so normal you. controls. All right, it's a normal game. Nice. Whoa, it's Sometimes laggy as shit though. Wow. Yeah, turn it, it's probably on Epic. I would turn it down. Apparently, you not even God's computer can game. handle this this type of quality. I could, yeah, I couldn't handle Epic either. Alright, this isn't too bad. I think you I need like this. Like a... Honestly, making shorts and videos about Palia, about like how to do things, probably would do really well, being the game came out yesterday. Give me a lot of like little kids or like non-gamer focused people trying to learn how to play. Oh, I just did it. You I like just flipped like through the entire map. Tapes? <laughs> <laughs> So what I've learned from the glitch is that there's two different cutscenes. So when you first launch in, you're kind of getting this like tutorial phase where it's kind of showing you what's going on. And that area shows a skybox and that's what you'll see here. The issue is like, can you not I get can back literally go the anywhere. I am got I can literally go anywhere. I can fall onto the map. <laughs> so this is me after the tutorial and walking over to that same area. You'll notice it's a bit different. Can you see me? Hey, what's going on, Nathaniel? Let's go. All right, I want to try over here. <laughs> this could be your thumbnail. Nice. Let's go, big moves. All right, let's see if we can go down to the map down here. Oh, wait, it's it's gone now. What? They do like a live patch? Dude, these are some shit ass what? Oh, I fell. Oh, I fell too? I fell through the map. <laughs> All right, shit, shit. What do we do, Nathaniel? I'm freaking out. My guy's freaking so I've only tested this glitch out for about an hour, so I don't know how it fully works yet. But it seems like in the tutorial phase, there that area that I showed before is kind of like a skybox. It's not really an area that you can fall into. But I don't, I don't know if you kids because the way is you have to do it right. You have to like get there diagonally. Yeah, and then I don't, I don't think it's gonna. There is one thing, though, that kind of piqued my interest, and I'd be interested if anybody else can get to this. There's a guy underneath the map, and I I don't know why, and, and it seems like you might be able to talk to him. So I encourage people to see if we can talk to this guy, because <laughs> that'd be really funny. I want to know what his, like, dialogue is. <laughs> oh, I'm falling to through the map, and I'm going to make it. Or... Wait, what who is if, that guy? What? what? There's one thing that I found out too, is that if you spam T as in Tom, it'll allow you to pull up the taunts and it'll allow you to essentially be able to hold yourself in the air. So that might help in the process of trying to get to this guy. I'm literally walking across the map. Am I moving though? Holy shit, he's actually doing it. He's actually legitimately looks like a speedrunner. Alright, All right, I got an idea. Hey, is the it directly versus outside of I also tried turning up my quality all the way to see if maybe I could lag the game a little bit to where I could go over there, but that didn't help. It kind of ran perfectly for some reason. I didn't do that. I'll tell you what, maybe we need to play one game or something before we can do it. Possibly. That's just annoying and true. So, uh, oh okay, so that's interesting. Obviously, this game is open beta, which means it's going to have some glitches. They're patching it. The, the game looks fantastic, actually. The animations look great. The gameplay seems like it's going to be great. Um, great game overall. Obviously, there's some glitches, and I know they're going to try to fix them as best as they can. Um, but it's still fun to explore while we have the opportunity. So thanks so much for watching. Have a good rest of your day.